welcome to another create a sim video i know that i said i probably wouldn't be doing too many of these but since i'm all about kind of more diversity on my channel this video i thought kind of show you guys a little bit more clothing from different cultures so i wanted to definitely share this for you also it is naya becoming the queen of oasis spring so i thought you guys would be pretty interested in that so i did want to share that but before we begin today's video i have a quick favor to ask you guys so there is this little boy that i found out about through the sims community because there's a simmer who's it's her friend's son so he just made a youtube channel and he's actually going through a lot personally so he made his youtube channel to have an outlet from everything and she got a few people to subscribe to his channel and it just made him so so happy so i know it would just mean the world to him if we were to get a few more subscribers so if you have a minute i'm gonna put the link to his channel in the description below if you have a minute just click on that link click subscribe that's all you have to do and of course if you're interested in his videos you can watch them but it's just it would mean so much to this child so i would appreciate it he would appreciate it his mother would appreciate it it would mean so so much to them it would be making a huge difference so it would be absolutely amazing if you guys could do that but anyway before we begin today's video don't forget to hit that subscribe button and to turn on your notifications if you have not already and let's go ahead and see princess Naya getting her makeover to turn into the queen of oasis springs okay so we have her outfit this is her current outfit as the princess and i definitely just like played around with a few different things you guys will see many many of course custom content i do fit i think i pick a few that are not custom content that come with the city living pack but for the most part it is custom content as you guys know the royal colors of oasis springs is like yellow slash gold and green too and i ended up going with a, something a little bit different for her, her formal outfit which you guys will see a little bit later but as you can see i played around with like a few different things i was trying to see things that were kind of like either indian or middle eastern inspired but i couldn't find too many that i loved i think i picked one or two outfits that are inspired inspired but for the most part I mean like yeah that gold one she had originally for her formal outfit it was kind of inspired but it wasn't like definitely not a traditional clothing for them so since she is queen I did want her to wear a little bit more traditional clothing but she is going to be queen so she's going to have all these like new rules and stuff like she can kind of help progress Oasis Springs and help like assimilate them into like European culture and all the other kingdoms cultures as well so I kind of just like seeing all the cultures kind of just adapting customs from different kingdoms it's just really cool and I just am excited to see how that's going to progress for like the, the future episodes and all of that too so for Princess Naya as you guys know she's currently dating Philip of Brindleton Bay he's an Earl of Brindleton Bay so he was made Earl really really young so that actually they got a lot in common having to get these titles at such like a young age and all of that too so for him I mean they're still teenagers she's got a while before she turns into a young adult so it's gonna be a while if they do get married it'll be a while before they actually get married so uh, and as you guys can see I played around with some henna tattoos but I actually don't think I have anything that I liked so I'm gonna probably have to search for more in like custom content like the sims resource or stuff like that because I was like I'd love to have have her have custom or no I'd love to have her have henna tattoos but mine were more like bohemian tattoos not like traditional henna tattoos so I definitely need to find something a little bit more I also tried to add some more jewelry cuz I I it's not like inspired specifically but well it is inspired by Indian and some Middle Eastern culture probably leaning a little bit more towards Indian I don't have any like hijabs or anything for them but I should download them because I there's this simmer named simmer Aaron and she does great great videos and her one of her videos was a kind of like diverse CC so she had all of these clothing and stuff from different cultures so she had some really cool hijabs and stuff in there so I probably will download that like later today or something like that but if you do want to check out that video I will put that in the link and I will put that link in the description below so you guys can check that out because she really does uh, showcase some really cool cuff. oh my god what am I trying to say she does showcase some really cool outfits from different cultures so you guys can definitely see that also as you guys can see I had well you guys could see I usually have them wear that hairstyle that comes with the city living pack that already has their hair kind of up in a bun and then it has the like the the headpiece with like the the I don't know what they're called but the jewel like that comes out in the middle of her forehead so that's kind of always been my hairdo for their queen for Oasis Springs but since it's going to be Queen Nea she might do things a little bit differently I actually end up going with this one that she has on right now definitely Definitely not culturally correct to Indian or Middle Eastern culture, but again, Oasis Springs.
Springs is kind of like just inspired by that so I've kind of made it like a little bit different so I thought it was really cool and I, d I didn't think it fit really any of the other kingdoms so I thought I might as well use it for Oasis Springs and I thought that Naya could have that as her new crown slash tiara so I thought that'd be really cool I also ended up changing her hairstyle to that so you guys could see before she had kind of more of a straight hair that was more like pinned up but now this one is like wavy and she still has her gorgeous long hair but she just looks so much more mature just after all this and she's still a teenager and all that too and that outfit she has on right now so I'm actually thinking of that as her future wedding dress so I'm so excited for whenever she gets married it comes in a few different colors so it has this yellow and to be honest I'm not the biggest fan of the yellow I love it comes in like pink and orange and blue too and I'm, I'm so obsessed with the blue and the pink too I I don't remember which one I ended up going with but I think that since green and yellow are their royal family colors I don't know I think that she is progressive enough to kind of decide like you know what it's my wedding day I will wear whatever color I want to so that's kind of what I went with for her outfit but I ended up choosing that so we'll get to see that later on this is what I ended up going with for her formal outfit and it's beautiful you guys and it does have that gold of like the royal family of oasis springs colors but it also has some red and blue in there too but like i don't think i'd ever give that to another queen of another kingdom so i was like you know what i might as well just use it for oasis springs for naya so i just end up going with that for her formal outfit and it's so so beautiful you guys i love it so so much i know i'm pretty sure most of this custom content is on my pinterest board and i just saw a comment today someone said well why don't you just like put it all in a folder for us to download and that is because the links that you guys see for custom content those creators get paid per link and they get the credit every time someone clicks on their link so i would never want to put it all in a custom content folder for you guys to just download because i feel like that's cheating out the creators so that's why i can't do that but i do understand that not all of my custom content is in my pinterest board and I understand that there is so much custom content in there so I apologize but I will I get most of my custom content from the Sims resource and I am a member of the Sims resource so I'm able to like search for things that I'm looking for and it's just so helpful if you are able to it's definitely worth it to pay like the four dollars extra per month but I am I'm a member of that so I will definitely as soon as I have the time will try to go back and kind of go into my history and put all those links in my Pinterest board so I, that, I will try to do that eventually but I apologize that not everything Thing is in there I think this is in my Pinterest board I apologize if it's not but I'll put the link to my Pinterest board in the description below so you guys can at least see I end up going with this for her party outfit again it's more red but it still has that gold in it and I thought it was just really really beautiful and that one is definitely more like inspired by Indian culture it's definitely not a traditional Indian dress uh, but I do I ended up going with like because I have that like gold leafy headpiece that she has on right now and I tried to go for that for like a lot of her outfits just because I know that they do wear like a lot of just gorgeous hair pieces and gorgeous jewelry but I think I probably need to find a little bit more like more gold hair pieces that look better because I don't know it doesn't it doesn't fit completely to me but I think it didn't look awful so I just ended up going with it I had a hard time baking her bathing suit too because I was like most of this stuff just looks like something from you would wear in like Sulani but I thought I don't even remember what I ended up going with for her bathing suit I honestly don't think I cared that much I was like I'm gonna pick something different something still like conservative if she's going to be the queen also I did have a lot of people in the last episode people were saying that she should have a queen is it Regent? A queen red regent? Regent? I have to look that up. I did not look up the pronunciation of that and I probably should have. But basically someone to ad be like her advisor because she is so young um, and this episode is actually about or the video is actually about to be over. So um, but I just wanted to say that like she will definitely have that. Her mother is going to be the queen regent. Right now I renamed her as queen mother Lindsay and that apparently that's like the traditional way. You're, it's basically like the mother of the queen because she's not supposed to inherit the throne and Queen Lindsay will be the one who kind of advises her through everything and kind of helps her with what she's doing because she's so young she's still a teenager she has no idea really but yeah so I hope you guys enjoy this I hope you guys like her outfits let me know what you think I'm so so excited for her to become the queen she looks beautiful guys I am so upset she looks so much older so mature she like really looks like a queen and I'm so so excited so if you enjoy this video give this video a big thumbs up hit that like button don't forget to subscribe and to turn on your notifications if you have not already and I will see you guys in the next video bye